Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for what is it around the second? So, second, third, whatever the timing is fluid. Um, keep in mind that not every reading is for you, so take what resonates and leave the rest, knowing that this reading is not sign specific. It may or may not be for you. Let's see what we got. What do we have? Ooh! Yay! So we got the moon and the page of swords reversed. So there's going to be some sort of difficult uh, message that is delivered. This is difficulty in communication. Could be uh, it, this, this could be something to do with a child because pages can signify children. This person may say something that uh, without thinking. Okay, um, they just speak. You know, they just say it. Whatever it is, this is a big talker. But this person is probably going to say something that they shouldn't have. You know, and it's going to reveal something. Something was hidden. There was a secret. There was something that, you know, they weren't supposed to reveal, but they reveal it um, without knowing. That's what I think this is. I think that we have that we have uh, somebody that just, uh, you know, sticks their nose into a situation and, you know, acts without thinking. Okay, and they and something gets revealed because of it, and I think that there is um there there whatever they say is is probably going to cause some sort of consequences that come about right around the full moon. I don't think I've ever said that, but that's what I see here. I feel like we 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 uh have somebody here that um just really really exposes something okay this is exposure of some sort all is not as it seems this person is going to say something without knowing what they're saying you know they don't think anything of it and they just say it hmm Time for a change. It is definitely time for a change. Now, this is about uh, exchanging, exchanging something for something better. Um, now, this is testing the water. So, somebody could come in and test this person, and boom, here it comes. You know what I mean? They just, they don't even think. They don't, you know, that's what I think this is, too. It's like this is, this is some sort of trick. It feels like it's some sort of trick. They ask this person a trick question and they don't and they get and they get their answer. They do. They get their answer. May have something to do with a mother, could have something to do with a wife. I don't know, but the Empress is a mother. It's somebody that is um very nurturing, very caring, very loving, and very abundant. This person adds value to a situation, okay, in the upright. This is a caregiver, but this is grieving. So, <laughs> this is grieving right here. All is not as it seems. This could be a grieving, a grievance of some sort. Not realizing that there's a better opportunity. Now, the Empress is somebody that is uh, very caring and heartfelt, very sensual, very beautiful. She demonstrates love. But the moon is, there's a hidden force here. There's something that is hidden. Ooh, Wheel of Fortune reversed. Ah, uh, the sun reversed. A lack of growth. Things, things are about to change. Something isn't growing the way that it should. There's no growth here. There's no vitality. Somebody, there could be some poor health and there's a need to heal. 
Now the wheel of fortune reverse. This is going. This is bad luck. This is a run of bad luck. Somebody isn't. They keep repeating the same patterns. They're not making the changes that they need. They're resisting change, and change is needed. With the wheel of fortune reverse, let me just focus that in so you can see it. Now there, there's there's some sort of. Uh, This could be like a horrendous loss of some sort, and I don't want to scare scare anybody. But this is a loss of a child. This could be a horrendous loss because somebody is fighting change. They're trying to block change. It's like the past mistakes keep coming back to haunt them. Somebody's past mistakes may be coming back to haunt them. It may now something may now be being shown. Okay. Um. Now, and this is a loss, and this is a loss. So I'm not sure what this loss is, but it doesn't look good. I mean, this is bad luck. There's been a delay. Um, <laughs> repetitiveness. There's repetitive patterns here. Somebody is just refusing to... You know, let the wheel spin. Now, this is this is bad luck, bad karma. There's been some sort of deception with the moon. Somebody's been pretending. There's been some sort of illusion. But in fake, fake. Somebody's been being fake. They haven't been being real. And remember when I first started this reading and I was talking and I was saying, you know, telling you about the time and thinking. You know, I was telling you about the timing and blah, blah. I was thinking to myself, shit is about to get real. So here we go. Um, now, this is a negative, unhealthy situation where there is no growth. This is the, Everything happens for a reason. Everything happens for a purpose. Somebody may have... This could be a karmic lesson of some sort. There is going to be some sort of exchange. Want something for something better. Um, there's going to be some sort of conflict or somebody is going to say something that reveals something that has been hidden. Um, we have a, we have, this could be a counselor. This could be a nurse. This is somebody that is very caring, very, um, compassionate and kind. This is somebody that, um, is very, uh, sensitive and emotional and loving and warm and, um, emotional supportive, emotionally supporting. This person is is going to be who this person speaks to. They're going to speak to this person who is listens. You know, this person is listening. This person is is engaged. This person wants to help. So this person is going to receive the message that uh, brings conflict. This is a conflicting message. This is an observation going on, some sort of investigation or observation of some sort. And it's like... There's going to be some sort of, uh, a, there's a need to bring balance back to a situation. Because this is balance is needed. Unhealthy. <laughs> this could be, this could be a nurse. Okay, or a counselor. Oh, we have somebody here that has a self-image problem. Somebody that is very, very, very focused on their body. Um... Not practical. Irresponsible. <clears throat> Not passing a test as well. This is my test card. One of them. We have somebody here that is being tested. They are being tested and they're not passing the test. Something is going to happen. Something is going to come to a stop. Okay, there's going to be some... A movement is going to be stopped. We have somebody here that is not acting with integrity. They're not following through with their plans. <coughs> we have an unhealthy individual here with this card and this card. This person isn't stable. They're not solid. They don't have anything of value to offer. They don't work hard. They're lazy. 
They have food issues. So we have somebody here that has some sort of food issues. This person is very intuitive. So this person, this person may see that this is not practical. This is not realistic. There's no growth here. This is an exchange because there's no growth. There's no vitality. It's a conflict, a conflict, a conflicting message being given to this caring individual. This person is very caring, very empathic. This isn't stable. There's extreme loneliness with the Hermit reversed, a need to reflect. And now I do feel like there's already been some sort of analysis because the Hermit is reversed. There's sadness. There's restrictions. Somebody has been really, really restricted. And, it, and it's time to come out of that hiding. It's time to reconnect. It's time to grow. It's time for happiness. Somebody has, there's been some sort of delay. They've been delayed. They've, they've been delayed in a lonely situation where they've been restricted, where there's no growth. Very solitary. But this person, this, the Queen of Cups is somebody who sees it all. Very intuitive. This is to regain strength. Mastering, both of these people are mastering their emotions. Well, this could be one person that is finding their strength and their courage and their confidence to move forward, to let go of fear because this is let go. The strength is about letting go of fear. Somebody has been really enjoying their power too. They've been in a really, they've been really trying to control another person. Really, really, really controlling. And I think we have, this person is going to see right through this person. This is somebody who is very, con this is. Restriction. Restricting another person from growth and happiness. There's some sort of truth that is going to come out. Communication. Somebody's going to get a wake-up call. There's an awakening here. Somebody is going to see that this person right here that is very empath empathic and in tune is going to see the truth about a situation. And there's going to be an exchange. This is an exchange. There's going to be some sort of renewal of some sort. Something is going to happen that brings balance back to an unhealthy situation. All is not as it seems. Somebody has been hiding. They've been hiding the truth. But the truth is about to be revealed. And this is grieving. Somebody is, is, is going to experience a heart, or they have experienced a heartbreaking loss. And it's time to realize that there is another opportunity, something that is better. This is crying over a loss, focusing on a loss. There could be some extreme regrets. Somebody could be experiencing some regrets for not telling the truth. For clinging to control. This is clinging to control and this is control. We have somebody here that has huge control issues but this is some sort of truth being delivered coming out about an unhealthy situation it's time for some tender loving care it really is it is time for tender loving care okay time tender loving care tender loving care somebody is in need of some tender loving care that's the truth so I feel as though somebody is going to receive a message, okay? Because um, this is communication. This is a message. Now the Three of Pentacles reverse is not seeing, not on the same page. With it. Somebody didn't 
didn't prove themselves to be who they said they were going to be. They they didn't uh, they didn't their skills weren't adequate for the job, right? I mean they they said that they could do the job, but they couldn't do the job. So somebody couldn't do the job here. But this person is very, very, uh, manipulative. And I don't need to manipulate. This person was really good at selling their story. They were really good at selling their story, saying that, you know, they were good and that they were great and that, you know, they, they were the shit. So they were really good at selling their story. But I do feel with the Six of Cups reversed that somebody is going to be relieved of their responsibilities. The Six of Cups reversed. This is freedom from obligation, packing up, leaving home. Okay, there could be some child neglect. Some child, Somebody may have been robbed of their innocence by a, a parent that was very, very, very controlling. Or another person that was really controlling. There's a this is robbed of innocence the six of cups reversed also nothing stays the same we could have somebody here that has selective memory they only remember what they want to remember and they only tell you what they what is going to help them it's a power it's and this is control and manipulation that's where the manipulation came from we have a very manipulative individual here that has been robbing perhaps a child or somebody of their innocence but this is the truth coming out. The truth being delivered. And this is no longer working together. There's a lack of respect. There's a lack of compromise. This is not uh, doing what you said you were going to do. Not being uh, qualified for the job. But saying that you were. So anyway. We have some. There's definitely some abuse. There's some abuse that is being revealed. Okay, there is. It's been hidden. It's been hidden very, very well. But I think that there is going to be some sort of communication that is had that reveals the truth. So yeah, uh, be prepared. Something that is hidden with that moon card. All is not as it seems. There's going to be an exchange, and I think it's an exchange of power. That's what it is. Just exchange of power. Right? I mean, isn't that what that is? This is, a, if somebody's going to be experience some bad luck because they didn't, do what they said they were going to do. They lied. This is, they lied. And here comes the truth. Good luck. 